Hi there, welcome to Dream. I'm Paul Bevan, Australia's number one property finance expert. Now, there's a lot of acronyms when you're applying for a loan and, and dealing with lenders, and one of those is LVR. Now, what does LVR stand for? Okay, LVR is the loan to valuation ratio. Now, lenders will use this in their credit policy to determine whether or not uh, the loan you're seeking fits inside their credit policy. Now, how do we calculate the loan to valuation ratio? Okay, it's simply your loan amount divided by the valuation of your security property. Okay, so if you're an owner occupier, you're looking to, to purchase a house to live in, uh, the amount of funds that you want to borrow, so the loan amount divided by the valuation of your property. Okay, now the valuation of your property, more often than not, will be organized by the bank with a licensed valuer who will provide a sworn valuation, okay? So it's not just what you think the property is worth, the bank will do their own valuation through a licensed professional to ascertain the value of that property. That will affect, obviously, depending on their credit policy, how much they are willing to lend you in terms of the loan to valuation ratio. Now, as an example, if your property is valued at $500,000, and you're seeking $400,000 as a loan, your LVR will be 80%, okay? Now, if you're seeking $450,000 as a loan amount on your property of 500,000, your LVR will be 90%. Now, the thing to keep in mind here is that magical 80% LVR, okay? Now, why I call it the magical LVR of 80% is that most lenders we will require you to take out a lender's mortgage insurance, another acronym, LMI, policy, if you are above 80% LVR, okay? And that's really an insurance policy for the lender, okay? Now, the other thing to keep in mind is the total amount you'll be able to borrow. Now, this changes quite often um, depending on lending policies. Now, at the moment, if you're looking to, to purchase a owner-occupied property, uh, you can still borrow up to a maximum of a 95% LVR, generally speaking, across the board, okay? So, if, if you've only got, uh, you know, around that 5% deposit and you want to borrow 95%, that, that's, that's the maximum that you're able to borrow, okay? Uh, depending on the lender as well, the lower the LVR, sometimes the, the better interest rate um, you will receive as well, but it does depend uh, on each individual lender and their, their credit policy and how they price. Okay, so that's it. The LVR, Loan to Valuation Ratio, basically your loan amount divided by the valuation of your security property.